From matters education to politics, leaders from Tanzuya County are urging their fellow politicians to engage in development issues and stop the political animosity that is contributing to the rising political temperature in the region. The discord, which had been simmering for weeks, finally erupted into physical confrontation as Stone Harling marred a funeral gathering in Gosset last week. This conflict traces its origin back to quest for Tainluya unity. Bushebe Jr. has prepared that story and he brings us the latest. Despite efforts over the years, achieving political unity within the popular Luya community has remained an elusive goal, with political rivals and observers mocking the ongoing pursuit of unity. We talk that we have numerical numbers, but you find that when it comes to the national election, our numerical numbers become politically irrelevant. Yet again, the recently witnessed dramatic political exchange that escalated to an open bloody burial incident that saw Natembeya's and National Assembly Speaker Moses Wetangula supporters clash during a funeral on Friday brought to light what is perceived as a supremacy battle over the region's political kingship. <laughs> Atuta kupari watarisha maisha ya wananji. Niansie viongozi wakisiasa. Kwa sababu hao vijana wako hapa, kila mmoja anajua hako na kiongozi wake. Na waurisa wasungumuse na hao vijana. Since then, a video has been making rounds showing Natembea addressing a crowd after the incident while making chants against Speaker Wetangula. The crowd responded with Tawe to every statement Natembea said, an assumption that a new movement has been launched called Tawe Movement, simply translated as No Movement. <laughs> Natembea has publicly dismissed Wetangula and Mudavadi as the region's political kingpins. The governor claimed that currently the western region has no political head who can negotiate on behalf of the community, arguing that Wetangula's position as speaker and Mudavadi as prime cabinet secretary cannot bring development projects to the region. <laughs> Western region yuko na mabunge karibu 45. Ford Kenya yuko na bunge 5. ANC yuko na mabunge gapi? 5. Hao wengine wao kwa jamaa gani? Watu wao kwa UDA, wao kwa Jubilee, wao kwa DAP, wao kwa Independent, wao wanaongoza nini? He said that other regions have leaders who are respected like Raila Odinga in Nyanza and Ruto in Rift Valley, but in Western, everybody wants to be a leader. Some lawmakers from Western Kenya have ganged up against Transoya Governor George Natembea for allegedly insulting National Assembly Speaker Moses Wetangula. Kwamba, let us tone down on these political issues. You are just raising the temperature for no apparent reason. Speaker wa inji hii, anashikilia nafasi ya muhimu sana na ya heshima sana katika inji hii ya Kenya. Vile vile mweshimiwa natembea kuwa governor wa jimbo 
wewe ni president ambaye unaongoza jimbo kubwa la Tanzania. Na hao watu walikupatia hiyo nafasi kwa sababu walikuamini. Sisi tunataka uiano mwema kati ya viongozi wetu kama watoto wetu. They say that Natembea was becoming a thorn in their flesh in their quest to unite the region behind Wetangula and Prime Cabinet Secretary Musale Mudavadi ahead of the 2027 polls. That Ford Kenya is coming to Transoya. Okay, we are going to compete. Yes. That seat you are holding was previously held by Vote Kenya. Oh, yes. And we are going to take it back. Yes. We are going to take it back. Yes. Prepare for very thorough competition. Okay? And and there's no way no Ford Kenya leader has talked about you. You should just stop talking about Wetango. And I want to talk with authority as the deputy party leader of this party and a woman. We don't want to see you calling Wetangula's name. And where there is no order, order will be brought by force, by fire. Ona kiamuka subui ata langi jafika. If Wetangula sija mefanya i, Wetangula mefanya i. That is a sign of a sick person. Is the Luyan nation on the verge of unity or facing potential disaster? And pia wako na pop. And wako na papa ya Roma uko. All things remaining equal, in a couple of months, mm -hmm. he will have confirmed himself as the king of Transoy and Bungoma. He will be moving further down. Natembe is running with Angle out of town. Are you not seeing a Angle running? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's running out of town. Yeah, okay. it's already happening. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's just to seal the deal. Seal the deal. Natembe almost is now the undisputed king of the Pukusu. <laughs> that one <laughs> okay. is almost there. Uh -huh. I, I think. There is no doubt about it. Mm -hmm. So Wetangula is running out of town. Okay. However, others are concerned about the challenges that arise, such as determining which Luya sub-tribe will hold power and who will represent Luya unity. Mutu atakuja na chama yake. Iyo italeta ukabila, italeta sisi tuweza kupoteza ile ukenya wetu ambao tuko nao. Tuko na vyama, tujenge vyama ambazo tuko nazo, hatu tukia na vyama kama tatu ama ine, ya kitaifa ambayo inajulikana hiko na kila mtu na sisi kama chama cha Ford Kenya tunasimama imara kwa alafu mtu ambayo is not seeking any votes himself anasimama kwa jukwa anasema now I want to determine who shall be the MP who shall be the president in this country no bandits argue that the outdated tribal leadership and kingdoms have diminished the region's political influence. Currently, National Assembly Speaker Moses Wetangula and Prime Cabinet Secretary Musale Mudavadi have been seen as the leaders who may or may not achieve Western unity. But this quest is likely to end up in smoke should the newly launched Tawe movement sweep the region. Kwa hii serikali ambayo hiko kuna watu jana wetu wako kule ndani Mudavadi hako ndani Wetangula hako ndani Hawa wawili ambayo wako juni watu wetu kapisa tunapea tunashimu Lakini kwa sasa kwa hawa wili Kama mweshimi wa rais ameenda kando gidoka mepotea Kwa hawa wawili nana naza kumandia gitu Ugenda hapa rift vale magirani yetu Mweshimi wa rutu wakisemba gitu nanya naza kupinga huko You can't Lakini ikuja hapa western hapa Sisi tu upia kifuwa o mimi ni namba tatu, mimi ni namba ngapi kwa zerekali. Very useless things. Sisi tulikuwa na namba mbili, omalo alikuwa namba mbili, mudi ya wari alikuwa namba mbili, nani mwengina alikuwa namba mbili, mudabati mwenyewa alikuwa namba mbili, sasa kwa ujinga yetu atunashangiria tukwa namba tatu. Natembea has started an onslaught to clear those leaders. Let's not hide. His focus for now is on Wetangula. But as soon as he's done with Wetangula, the rest will fall in. This is a caterpillar. It's a bulldozer. It's going to clear. It's already clearing Wetangula. The Tembe, after clearing Wetangula, and this is going to be very soon, is going to of course, Eugene Omola will fall by the wayside. It just Western Kenya, like other parts of the country, is undergoing both political and economic dynamics 
And this move comes at a crucial time when the Mulembe nation is on its knees with the challenge of poverty and political division. Various leaders have stressed the significance of unity in shaping the future of the region. The current National Assembly Speaker Moses Wetangula emphasized that unity in the region is not a choice but a necessity that must be acknowledged. However, Transoya governor doesn't believe Wetangula or his political party forward Kenya has any accolades to spearhead the said unity. Nevertheless, it remains to be seen whether the charismatic duo of Wetangula and Mudavari can overcome historical divisions, including the Tawe movement and garner widespread support among the diverse range of Luya sub tribes. Can the Luyas ever unite? Absolutely, pundits say. However, the key to Luya unity does not lie in any tribal or political leader. The core issue, as they argue, that must be addressed is poverty, which is the biggest fundamental problem causing disunity in the western region. Pandits argue again that while many may assume that the region is poor, the reality is that there are untapped and unused resources that could be utilized to uplift the mental and physical resources of the people. Others like George Natembea believe that Luya political leaders must stop exploiting the community for their own selfish interests and instead focus on lifting their followers out of poverty. Jin has had opportunity. Mm -hmm. has had for the longest time. Mm -hmm. Wetangula has had and he still has. Yeah, yeah, but they have yeah. never used it. And so, mm -hmm. they are being... I um, just want to make it clear. Mm -hmm. Netembea is now clearing with Wetangula. Mm -hmm. In the process, almost simultaneous, Eugene will be forgotten. Mm -hmm. Then his focus will be on Dabadi and Oparanya. Mm -hmm. For Maisha Prime, Maisha Television, Ambushabi Junior. Oh, my